So I want to show you a little bit of what I'm using here today for photo equipment. Um, I've got my tripod, which you're sitting on right now, um, and I use that occasionally. Always carry it with me. You never know when you're going to need it. Um, I've got my Canon digital SLR. I've got a small flash with this uh, cardboard flash diffuser that I built myself. Um, basically, it just uh, distributes the light and diffuses it right in front of the lens. When you're doing close-up photography, it's important to not get uh, that flash right on it, which will usually wash out your picture unless you've got a special setup. I can tilt the flash down a little bit with this little uh, flash adapter right here, and I built this cardboard box, which just gives me a, a bright, even light, kind of right above what I'm taking a picture of. I'm using some uh, macro extension tubes um, with uh, just a standard lens that came with my camera. What the macro extension tubes do is they allow me to take my, my regular lens, um, mount it uh, to the camera with these extension tubes added on. Now, if you want to look at these, there's three different ones. You can stack them together. There's nothing inside, no glass. It just spaces the lens further from the camera. By doing that, um, it basically uh, crops the picture without losing any resolution. Um, you're able to just uh, focus in on, on just the center of what would normally be coming through the lens. Now, uh, if you're using a digital camera, like I am, the standard digital lenses will usually not fit on these regular extension tubes. You will have to have a regular lens um, made for 35 millimeter. Now, I have not looked into whether or not there are any extension tubes available for these SLRs because I've had these for years and they work just fine with the lenses that I've got. Um, they also make actual macro lenses um, that are made specifically for close-up photography and they work very well. Uh, they also uh, make a lens reversal ring, which basically allows you to take the lens, it screws on like a filter, and you take that lens and mount it on the camera backwards. Um, it kind of acts like a magnifying glass right on the end of your lens. If you ever take your camera lens and look through it backwards and use it like a magnifying glass, you will get some, some very significant magnification. But uh, that's my basic setup. And again, um, unless you're going to be hand-holding uh, very, very bright days outside, you definitely want to use a, a flash, flash diffuser. It's uh, really hard to get in that close to something and not block out all the light, so you want to have some type of illumination. Um, but that's my basic setup, and uh, hopefully I'll have some good pictures to show to you all today. There'll be a slideshow um, after this, and if I come across any, uh, any tips or tricks out here in the woods, I'll be sure to let you guys know. Thanks.